Hey everybody, Michael the Tutor 16 here. Today I'm going to be doing tutorial number five in Microsoft PowerPoint. And the topics for discussion in this tutorial will be that I'm going to show you how to add tabs to your ribbon toolbar in Microsoft PowerPoint. The advantages would be that by adding tabs to your ribbon toolbar, you'll save time by quickly accessing commonly used functions to help you while you create your slideshow presentation. So let's go into Microsoft PowerPoint and I'm going to show you how to add tabs to your ribbon toolbar. As you can see, I've gone into Microsoft PowerPoint and today I'm going to show you how to add tabs to your ribbon toolbar. Your ribbon toolbar is located toward the top of your screen, directly beneath your quick access toolbar, which is located at the top left hand corner of your PowerPoint software. Your ribbon toolbar contains tabs like File, Home, Insert, Design, Transitions, and all of these other tabs just to the right. And underneath each tab, you'll see all of the associated commands that are linked directly to the tab itself. So under my Home tab, I've got my clipboard, slides, font, paragraph, drawing, and editing commands. And again, all of these commands fall directly beneath the Home tab in the ribbon toolbar. If I click on my Design tab, you'll see that I've got my page set up, my themes, and my background commands. And all of these commands fall directly underneath the Design tab in the Ribbon Toolbar. In later tutorials, I'm going to show you how to build and work with macros. And to do this, you're going to need to add the Developer tab to your Ribbon Toolbar. I don't have the Developer tab, so if I want to add it, I'm going to go down and click on my File tab in my Ribbon Toolbar and select Options. Once in Options, I'm going to scan down my list and I'm going to highlight and left click Customize Ribbon. When I do this, you'll see all of the tabs that are in your Ribbon Toolbar. Under Developer, you'll see that there will not be a check mark. So to add the Developer tab to your Ribbon Toolbar, click where it says Developer and add the check mark to the box and then go down and click on OK. When you do this, you'll see that the Developer tab has now been added to your Ribbon Toolbar. And if you click on it, you'll see that you'll be able to work with all of your macro commands and even work in Visual Basic. So this is how you add tabs to your Ribbon Toolbar in Microsoft PowerPoint. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the subscription button located at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. If you have any questions or comments, please send them to me and I'll be more than happy to answer them. I hope you have a great day and thank you for watching.